secret U.S. team of scientists and military who experimented on aliens and U.F.O. Members of an alleged top secret team of scientists and U.S. military bosses who experimented on crashed flying saucers and dead aliens have been named. The identities of the late officials are revealed in what conspiracists say is a leaked document from the U.S. Defense Intelligence Agency, DIA, from the 80s. The 47-page alleged above top-secret file had been released and contained claims the 1947 Roswell UFO crash did happen, dead aliens were found and there was a major cover-up to hide the truth. The document is said to have been given to Heather Wade, host of U.S. late-night online paranormal radio show Midnight in the Desert, from a known source who has not been named. Many UFO experts have branded the document fake. But the release has set the conspiracy theory world on fire, with others convinced it could be genuine. The document claims a highly secretive team of top scientists, government officials and military leaders, all now dead, was set up in the wake of the Roswell incident to investigate the captured flying source remains and four dead aliens and assess the risk to the planet of visiting aliens. The document claims the group was called Majestic 12 and set up on the orders of President Harry S. Truman, in the wake of Roswell. It identifies these people as the original members. Lloyd Veal Berkner, an American physicist and engineer, who died in 1967 aged 62, and had investigated the Earth's atmosphere. Ditl F. Wolf Bronk, another U.S. scientist, educator who died aged 78 in 1975, and was recognized for developing biophysics as an established science. Vannevar Bush, an American engineer and inventor and science, who led the U.S. Office of Scientific Research and Development during World War II. It carried out military research and development. He died aged 84 in 1974. Donald Howard Menzel, who died in 1976 aged 75, who was one of the first theoretical astronomers and astrophysicists in the U.S., and discovered the physical properties of the solar chromosphere, the chemistry of stars, the atmosphere of Mars, and the nature of gaseous nebulae. Hoyt Sanford Vandenberg, a U.S. Air Force general, its second chief of staff, and second director of central intelligence who died in 1954 aged 54. Nathan Farragut Twining, who died in 1982 aged 84, who was Chief of Staff of the United States Air Force from 1953 until 1957, and during the Roswell UFO incident. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. If you like donate to us visit home on the page PayPal.